Hey, how's it going, my fuckers? Today we are about to to react part two, so let's do this shit. Well, here we are. The rank higher. Well, I don't know why you even bother protesting. All right, so apparently the most intelligent animal in the world is a chimpanzee. That is, if you forgot that humans are also animals. Oops. Number two. We are animals since the beginning, you idiot. Is gorilla. Number three, four, five, six are all monkey type creatures. Maybe looking at Gibbon going, what is that? Well, I'll show you. A Gibbon is this. You might relate to this picture as they look like your mom and dad when they fight. Fuck you. Let's see how your parents look like. Oh, yeah, they look like dogs. Each other. Your mom is probably the tan one. This is why you should be mad at killer whales being stuck in SeaWorld, because that's right, they're the seventh most intelligent animal in the world, again, excluding humans. Then there's the dolphins. No eating dolphins for you. And what's straight? Uh. I don't know, is there, a, is there a thing for dolphins that can make food out of it? But if they do, then fuck them. They hope they start to die. We, just, we haven't seen dogs yet. Maybe dogs aren't as smart as we thought they were. And there's the elephant. You guys feeling pretty confident? Glad you promised me that you would never ever again eat. Uh, I'm not gonna eat elephants. And thank God that I'm not living in Africa. An animal that is more intelligent than a dog? Alright, and number 10, feeling solid about this. Hey! That's right, pigs are more intelligent than dogs. But no one in America eats pigs, right? Because that would be embarrassing for us to be upset about the dog thing. And here's another- And that part, I don't get you. I just, I don't get you in that part. Another list of animals. I want to be honest if I didn't show you this list because it's on the same page. This being the less popular list, some people seem to believe that crows are smarter than dogs. Which, which they're scavengers and they're actually pretty smart, yes. It's crazy because a crow brain is like that. <laughs> Not exactly sure I'm gonna appreciate this list over the more popular list, but at least they list dogs as number six while again pretending humans don't exist. Let me show you more cruelty of one of the most intelligent animals in the world being harmed by these obviously not so nice Chinese. Here's some cute dogs being. They're not dogs, they're pigs. And to those people who, who, who did this to them, fuck you and burn in hell. Held in a cage in China. These dogs are all being penned down in their- They're not dogs, they're pigs. And fuck the person who did this. Cages. These dogs don't even have enough room to turn around in their cage. Fuck them. And the people who did this to these poor pigs. It's all the cruelty of the Chinese. Here's a dog with no doubt a Chinese person- Okay, that person needs to get killed by the gun itself. I hope you shoot yourself, who person who point that gun to a to a poor pig. Seriously, I hope you shoot yourself. Holding a gun to them. Oh, the cruelty! More Chinese abusing dog. Fuck them, and they say time assholes, all of them. It's only awkward. It actually is the Chinese. The title to this is Pig Abuse Gate. Chinese youth beat. Ugh. China, I'm trying to make a point about America. Can you not actually beat the pigs that I'm calling dogs for the sake of irony? Here's a dog singing about how hard it is to be a dog. There's not a dog, it's a pig. And the person who's doing that thing with this poor pig, I hope you die in hell for all eternity. Like onion faggot. In China. Oh my lord, lord come down and save me. I'm a pig. Uh, okay. <laughs> In one point, I mean, it is funny because making that voice, but still, these things are asking us for help. So stop making it funny and just help them out. People have suffered. My people have suffered. Oh, Lord, gonna save me. Uh -huh. Here's an obvious non American because. What the fuck, dude? You had a horrible fashion sense. The guy in this picture. And at the same time, fuck him. He's not even attractive anyways. Just like Onision. Americans are just the best people in the world. Posing in a picture next to a dog. Almost like celebrating its There is not dog. It's a fucking pig, you fucking idiot. God, what you stupid? Yeah, that's just awful. China, why do you do this? Why can't you be more like America? Over 56 billion animals are killed every single year. In the United States, who's obviously holier- Uh, you're forgetting one fact that humans actually kill more humans than, than any before, so... 
Are you forgetting that fact? You only faggot piece of shit. Even thou contributes to zero of those deaths, which is why we have the right to judge. See, this is what Americans look like. This is Rob. <laughs> um, Robert Williams, rest in peace. You're my favorite actor, and I put that black pick. That's a cute one. Now that is a cute picture, and that is harmless. Now that's the part that I will enjoy. Robin Williams with a baby pig. And I'm pretty sure no one in this picture is dead now, right? The pig's still alive, and obviously Robin Williams is still alive, right? Because America is the best place to live in the world. And here's just an illustration of... Fuck that guy. I hope he dies in the city that burned in hell. And go kill yourself, sir. How we Americans treat our animals. See, that's a pig, one of the smartest animals in the world. And that nice man is giving that pig a face massage with his foot. Yes, this photo is apparently actually from the UK, but that's why I said it's an illustration. Here's another illustration of what Americans could be found doing with. Well, I find this one harmless, and it's saying that that's that's fine. Because who knows? Pigs need massages anyways. And I know it's dirty. I know it is, but. They had to go do it. I mean, you don't want to be left a pig with no massage, are you? The pig, they're clearly giving the pig a mud massage, which no doubt is a luxurious experience. And here's another lovely illustration of assholes, both of them, and I hope they die as well. Americans giving a pig more massages with their feet. We Americans are actually such good people. They're not massages, you idiot. They're God, what well, you stupid? Being kicked is not massaged. It's like be taking a massive strike by a stick. To our intelligent animals that will play fun games with the animals. Like, here's a picture of a guy asking a pig if it wants to go out. No, it's not asking to play. It's asking to get beat up. And at the same time, that guy needs to burn in hell and he needs to die. Play baseball. That's what's really going on in this photo. Now, when I googled, are pigs smarter than dogs? The first thing that showed up is pigs outperform three-year-old human children on cognition tests and are smarter than any domestic animal. In other words, pigs are smarter than both your dogs and your cats. Oh, and your children who are three and younger. But we don't have anything called a pepperoni pizza. Because if you ate those, you would be... Skip the pizza, dude. Eating an animal that's more intelligent than a young toddler and an animal that tastes just like human beings. Or at least that's what Google suggested search seems to think. And I suppose as a result, humans also taste like whiskey. Mm. But I want you guys to look at this dog. Many Americans consider dogs to be much cuter than... Which they are. On the faggot. And... And I hope this person who is doing this to this dog, and I hope he's not trying to keep them dead, that please somebody save these dogs. Pigs, and despite pigs being more intelligent, <coughs> we non-superficial Americans are all about the exterior. So now we have to be upset because we, of course, don't eat pigs, which are more intelligent. Well, we don't. But in our society, we just live in the world of confusion and just all-out insanity. In the billions every year. And the Chinese are the people who we should... Well, the Chinese people, they need to die because for doing this meat fest shit. Be upset with, not ourselves. That would be too honest. Also, one more thing. There's a pork festival in Concord, New Hampshire. There's also a Virginia pork... Well, I find that pig a little bit... <laughs> that, is, that is a funny picture, though. <laughs> I know it's a pork fest. But I find that picture of that pig with the sunglasses, that's that's pretty cute and that's pretty funny. Pork festival. Here's what you can expect to see at a pork festival, the Eugene Pork Festival. Oh. And thank God that I'm not, I'm not eating pigs. Because if I were eat, I well, might as well shoot myself or kill myself. Oh, the humanity. But humans aren't supposed to be... Oh, humans are supposed to be eating pigs, but yes. We're not supposed to do that. But you, Onion Cow, you're the different picture. So, off with the facts and get the fuck out of here. Vegetarian. Well, that's why I've been a vegetarian. And thank God I'm not a vegetarian because vegetarians have bad side effects. Oh, yeah. Are you forgetting that also vegetarian gets bad side effects because if you eat a non food item for example a apple who either has some sort of a disease or something 
that's a bad side effect and I don't want to end up like you with that disgusting skinny body I already have my body that I'm looking for which is this one so yeah fuck off since I was 23 and now I'm 31 and somehow I'm still in great health that is so no you're not in great health you're a disgusting thing I ever see in my life get out of here oh weird regardless honest people you have a lovely day boob squeeze Look at that face. Just look at that face. That's the face that he is making a... A face that you people will not forget. And besides, he's a pervert. 100%. So, let's get the fuck out of here. In conclusion, Anika is a sociopathic rat. And I hope those people who did to these animals, they die. And to Chinese people who making these dog fest, they need to die. So yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you folks in the next video. Burning hell to all those who kill dogs.